Hello, this is Alex Steele back with another Mod Shapes. And today, I'm going to reveal the new and improved mermaid artwork I have in mind as a gift for Tall Girl Sydney. It was February of 2017 when I attempted my first real mixed artwork with stone, resin, and an illustration that was printed on transparency paper. I used Pearl X pigments in this original attempt. It was a decent effort. But since then, I have made so many more things out of resin. I think I've improved my technique. The process of making this was so similar that I didn't remake a video. This approach, using alcohol inks instead of Pearl X pigments, opens up a little bit of possibilities. I was able to place a small amount of alcohol ink in the resin and then use a stick, the very sharp end, and really control the design. I was also able to use fewer items to embed, and this helped me communicate the idea more effectively, I believe. The illustration is much, much bigger in the second version. This took about 15 or so ounces of resin and was completed in four steps, each time letting the resin cure to a semi-hard state before moving on to the next. The first layer had about 12 hours to cure, and it was roughly three to four millimeters thick, and that served as a base so that I could start positioning elements. The second layer had about six ounces or so of resin and that allowed me to place the rocks which are crystals and also the smaller aquarium rocks which have different colors on the canvas then i was able to add the blue white and the gold blue and the white became the waves the title of this by the way is the mermaid queen the third pour was another six ounces of resin but this was a pure resin with absolutely no colorants or any kind of embedding. And the fourth pour was another batch of resin with no color added. However, I did drop a few small of the colored aquarium stones so that there would be a little bit more depth. Not too many, just enough. Now there are some obvious flaws that you can see if you hold this up to the light. None of these flaws are going to be obvious um, when I present this as a gift. Thank you for watching this video. It really helps us a lot. If you don't mind, uh, put a like on it if you enjoyed it. Hope you have a fantastic day.